G'day ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Life is Strange. Now, last time what happened was we found out we're Superwoman and we're going to save a bitch. And to me. Yeah, wonder why. Anyway, uh, let's let's talk to her. Nice answer, Max. Are you okay? You look pale. You look dead. Um, well, did we I... talk at all today? This is the first time. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I'm just dripping. Too much stress. <laughs> Not more than you, though. Uh, I wish we didn't. I wish we didn't. I do have to go, but we can talk later if you want. I'll see how I feel. Thanks, Max. Hitting some of the wacky tobacco? <laughs> Not in my school. What are you waiting for? Go! Oh, right. That's right, we gotta save a person. I see you, Max Caulfield. Oh. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your interest. Oh, Jesus Christ. What do you want? I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Um. Uh, any mini. I'm not avoiding. I'm not avoiding, just. Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Bingo! Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Good point. Let's Go give it to him. Don't let me stop you. See ya, bitch face. Uh, use control. Wait, what did I do? I see you, Max Carl. Oh God! Don't eat. All right. Yes. Want a photography? Yes. Okay. Not sure if I have one. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure I have one. Oh wait, hold on. Oh. Giving yourself the output. I'm sure you must have about a thousand pics by now. It'll take a long time to find a good one. Max. All right. Yes. Yes. Sorry, everyone. I fucked up. All right, let's let's talk. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson. Can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. Shut up, no, bitch. Victoria. Excuse us. I'm fucking I've never up. Never let one of photography's future star. Yes. John Lennon said. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Damn right. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Uh, I could take a photo of the girl's corpse. That could be a thing. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. All right, come on. I can't tell anybody. Break it up until we jog. I know, you probably are crazy. Yes, we've already seen all this vending machine. Sugar dispenser, yep. Enter. Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. Yep, that happened. I shredded my photo. You did that too. And the butterfly flew in. Yep, take and another I photo. Took the photo. Okay, everything's going well. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing um, around with. Stop singing. What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down. Tell me what to do. Wow, sir. I need a hammer to break it open. A hammer? You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody oh God. ever even Take it. your punk ass, would they? Get that gun Probably not. Me, psycho. Oh. Holy shit, I can't let this happen. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh wait, hold on. No, fucked up again. Ever even miss your hammer. punk ass, would they? No way! Don't ever touch me again, freak! Another shitty day. Oh god. School massacre! That did not happen. This cannot be real. Oh, well, good thing I can read one time. And then saved her. What the fuck is going on? I don't know. Do not freak out. It's time to leg it. Hey, 
Do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Fuck off, Girls Kappa. always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. I'll punch in you your mustachio huh? face. Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Yeah. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Damn right, mustachio. <laughs> Told by the man in power. Yes. Oh, thanks for saving my ass. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm, Sorry, y'all get killed then saved her. Just a little worried about my future. Or my past. Dive traveler. All you're thinking about. You could always be upfront with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Oh no! Oh god! Um. Oh, fuck it, report him. I don't like him anyway. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott? You sure? Yep. Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. Damn right. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Craziness happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family. And I'm here to ruin and them. one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Stop then, asking me questions. Then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. Who cares? I'm a superhero. After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Come on, he owns the of town. this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? Hmm. 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 Should I? Should I? Hmm. Mustachio, help me. Um. Oh. Oh god, I don't- I hate choices. Oh my god. Oh god. This is getting complicated. Max, you better go on outside. Oh, fuck off. Um, can I- no. Oh, fuck. Sh should I- oh. oh, I hate choices in games. Um. Yeah, he might knock on us. Quickly, we gotta tell. We gotta get- we gotta get out of there. Come on, force. It could be in hella shit. You look a little stressed out. Yeah, we're right. Hide the truth. I just got sick in class. Um, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. Told and you, you female think that's trouble. That's the first time a student has used that line on me. It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that teen toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks, and you're already causing conflict. Oh, what I don't do think I know? your parents will approve when they find out. Oh. I'll outside with the class. Please. No, he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed yep, my Yep, fuck it. We're doing it again. <laughs> yes, I could rewind and actually tell him the truth. Told you, first instinct's always the best. Yep. Report him. Just saw Nathan. Yep, shit happened. It was bad. Let's run. Alright. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. <laughs> I got confused.
Anyway, we reported the fucker, so. Nice campus. Would Nathan Prescott please come to the front office? Ooh. Hey, Miss Grant. How's it going? Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Anything, anything for you, Miss Grant. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? Who cares? I'm signing it anyway. And our chief of security wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus, halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. I agree, Miss Blackwell. That's crazy. I get why school should be on high alert these days, but cameras in the dorm rooms. It's hmm. a slippery slope. And it's up to you and your classmates to stand up here. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage. From the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. Native Americans? The Native Americans? The tribes who were here first who welcomed the settlers. Both cultures found a mutual symbiosis and thrived. Now before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Yep. Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell yeah. for a good reason. No worry, Miss Grant. Hey girls, what's going on? What's going on? Hey Stella. Hey, leopard print. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? I know, it's so hot. Oh, I think so. I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher. And I actually love his work. Me too. <laughs> Just cut off his that New York bitch. urban stuff is great, but I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. Screw the East Coast elite. Damn right. They must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. Mm -hmm. Plus he is pretty hot for an older guy. I oh, know. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. Now that you mention it. Ew. Now that you mention it, he doesn't respond to Victoria's flirting. That means he has good taste. You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. What? Well... I heard that from a good source. Pedophilia! You knew Rachel? So, you knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind of click. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. Alright, well. Okay. Yes, it's a fountain. No, we don't have time to sit. Let's find the blue haired girl. Or Brooke. Let's talk to Brooke. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? Yes. Yes. I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? No, but let me fly it. A weapon, right? Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny. Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Let's rewind that. That's right, I'm gonna be flying your drone. Hi, Brooke. Yep, we already did this. Oh. Is that really yours? Is that even legal? Of course. Nobody knows about it yet. Isn't it considered a weapon of war? Uh, you read too many conspiracy. Right, okay. Yeah, I'm a conspiracy theorist. <laughs> what a complicated name for such a tiny drone. <gasps> I know what I'm doing. Okay. Hi, Brooke. Let yeah. me get. That's a high fly drone, that right? It's like a high fly drone. Model B400 EVO. Now, that's a nice piece of tech. You're full of surprises. Why would you know that? Right I in love your bag. photography. 
Drones are perfect for that, especially those with great range. It's a new era of images. Most impressive, Max. Warren said you were multifaceted. Yay. Here, give the drone a whirl around camp. Yes. Wait, I can't actually steer this. Oh. Get her. Okay, well. Don't break the fucking thing. Whee. It's the skater kids. Let's go say hi to them next. Um... So is there any point to this? I guess not. Alrighty. Skater kids. Oh, Tab Warren? What? Oh, uh, don't ignore the- Oh, what? No! What's going on? Okay, let's... Um, not to study, please. Bust shit up. Uh, don't ignore this message. Space, hello. Sorry running late, insane day. I'll meet you in the lot. Looking cool, you'll see. The camera will be ready to see you shortly. I hope so. Alright. Oh, okay. After four, hey Max, you're around always, you okay? I'm gonna get tea later today, absolutely, I'll be free after four. Uh, don't know what that means. Uh. Oh, yay! Happy birthday, mummy, yay! Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. But first, let's talk to the skater kids. Ooh, Justin. He looks like a cool Yo, guy. Justin. Check out the Max. Come to Thrash? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah? Bring it. What's your first move gonna be? Uh... Jump. Jump? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Oh, I know things now. Yo, Justin. Check out the Mac. I came to nose slide. I came to nose slide. But I'd love to see somebody do a tree flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Damn right. Nah. I just can't skate worth shit. Oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? I I know what a nose slide is. Don't know what a tri flip is. So Go let's see that. Tree flip. Let's get Trevor all over that action. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Giggle. Let's kick him. No, oh, he'll take a picture. That's even better. Rachel Amber forever. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, what? What? Oh, um. Uh. Yeah. Yeah, I don't. I don't care enough. Yeah, she's a bitch. He's an alright guy. He's sexy. She's awesome. He's a douchebag. She's a stoner. He is white supremacy. Okay. Hey. I'm stoked to see those photos framed and shit. You're not really a skate Betty though. Oh, I used to be. Oh, back in the day. I used to grind with all the professionals. Yeah, not really. <laughs> not really. Too bad. It's nice to have the females on board too. Rachel Amber and her punk friends love skating with us. Punk friend? Who was Rachel's punk friend? I can't remember her name. She was hot. Tats, blue hair, hardcore. She stopped hanging out with us after Rachel disappeared. <laughs> Ran away. 
You knew Rachel? You knew Rachel? She used to chill with us sometimes. But one day she just vanished. I hope she's living the dream somewhere. If anybody hurt her, we'll get a skate posse and take them out with our boards. Yeah. No, you won't. Did you ever hang out with Victoria? Fuck that. I'd rather rollerblade than hang out with snobs like her. Okay, let's chill later, buddy. Let's chill later, Justin. Anytime you want to take some action shots, we're here for you, Max. Okay, enough with the sexual innuendos. You know what? I don't roll like that. Um, Blackwell Academy. Let's go this way. I don't know what I'm doing. That's a swimming pool. And this is where the otters perform their aquatic magic. Okay. Oh, where am I meant to go? Parking. Leaflet. Missing person. Um, is there like a, like a missions menu? I need to go to my room to get Warren's flash drive. Where's your fucking room? Man, this is too... Actually, should I be reading these? Alright, so this is just, uh... Right, okay. So that's just shit that, uh, happens. No, don't, don't. Fuck off. Uh, athletics. Ah, dormitories. Here we go. Okay, you, you know, you could uh, pick up pick up the pace a little bit, love. Hey, it's Evan. Let's speak to Evan. No, I want to speak to fucking Evan. Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? Eugene. Gotta be Eugene Smith. Well, they both were famous war photographer images, but you should know the difference. Good try. Wrong answer. Hey, Evan. Let's see if you're... All right. Uh, Robert... Is it Robert Dornau? Dornau. Oh, my. You can't even tell the difference between street photography and photojournalism. No portfolio peak for you. Why don't I just look at it? Evan's portfolio always looks so uber pro. I'd uh, love to see his photos in there. Sorry, I have to get back to my portfolio. All right. No time for amateurs. No offense, Max. I'm not an amateur. I have time travel on my side. Hey, Evan. Okay, third Let's time's the charm. Steve McCurry. Uh, Steve McCurry? Unless he could travel back in time. McCurry was born five years after the falling soldier picture. Oh, God. McCurry also shoots in color. In other words, no portfolio. Oh, yeah, fuck. Ah. Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if... Robert Kappa? Robert Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My, my. This quiet child knows things. Damn right. That's why I'm here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? Why do you it's think I answered your stupid I question? I'd be honored, sir. Alright, let's read it. Rachel, Rachel. Abstract landscapes. Okay. Uh, you knew Rachel? Hi, Evan. As you can see, Rachel Amber was my favorite model here. She knew exactly what angles worked best with my eye. You were close? You were close. Like brother and sister in arms. She understood me, never judged me. I hated her vortex club click, but she never acted like she cared. Her friends were her friends. What huh. do you think happened to her? Nothing good, Max. Nothing good. He knows shit, this guy. 
But I'm done speaking to him. Oh, the dormitories. Oh, left mouse, but right. Jesus Christ, there's a lot of people to talk to. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Uh, Logan? Hey, Logan. No, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. Ah, uh, fuck off, Ski. What are you here? Uh, hi, Max. How, uh, what? Uh, how are you? How are you doing? Fantastic. No. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. <laughs> Pretty soon I'll be bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. I think you're better off reading chiclet. Good point. Now, if you'll excuse me. Alright. You antisocial bitch. Um. Oh. Uh. Hey, fuck off. Oh, look. It's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. A punch in the throat. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. I might. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Damn right. Kicking the teeth. Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. We'll just kick her in the face. Oh, Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Can we make like something collapse on top of her? Can we oh can we up the sprinklers? Let's up the sprinklers. Hey Mr. Janitor guy. Really? We can't we can just look at him. Hey! Are you kidding? Look at this! Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Oh, cashmere. You know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. Awesome. Oh, bitch face, get her shit ruined. Oh, never mind. Do you, do you understand English? Get lost. Alright, well now what? Okay, we fucked her dress up. I don't know, can we fuck her face up this time? Can we electrocute her? <gasps> Paint! <laughs> oh yes. Oh yes. Give me something to throw at it. Here, let me climb. Um, oi, football guy. Throw it. Throw it. No, okay. Oi, you're a jockish looking person. Throw it. Give me the foot. Throw the fucking football. Ugh. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's very nice. No, give me the fucking. Um. I don't know, maybe we can climb up this. Damn, I missed something. I better rewind. Yeah, I know what the fuck he did. How the fuck do I get it down? Keep walking, hippie. She looks like a pissed off wet cat, and she's still stylish. <laughs> and she's still stylish. Intercept. Intercept the ball. How in fuck's name? Oh, get, get pick pick the fucking can up. What am I meant to do? Okay, I'm missing something here. I'll be back once I find it. Hey, hey, Samuel. Oh. I can't grab that. 
Samuel is way too close. I got it, guys. I figured it out. Okay, let's see if this works. Sorry, Sammy, buddy. What the hell? Yeah, we fucked your dress up. Sorry, Sam. You're not a bad guy. No way! No yes! Oh, Samuel, is sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Hey, don't you call Samuel a weirdo. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Damn right. Hey there, you're looking lovely. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Oh, <laughs> I'm an asshole, sorry. Don't. Don't say a word, Max. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. And no filter needed before I post this. Now, please move. I've had a messed up day, and I'm going to my room. You do that? I know where you live. So does Nathan. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Now I have to get to my room, then see Warren. No, oh. <laughs> damn these moral dilemmas. Anyway, she was a bitch. I didn't like her. I'm not a nice person. But maybe if I comfort her, no, nope, fuck it. I'm out. Anyway, uh. Sorry guys, I'm going to have to leave it here. Um, if you liked the video, like, comment, and subscribe. If you didn't like the video... Oh, never mind. If you liked the video, do all of the above, and uh, fuck it, just love me. Um, anyway, that's it for me. See you guys later.